My name is Paul Lipson. I'm SVP here at Formosa Group Interactive, and we are an end-to-end -end post production team that specializes in sound design, music, voiceover, and integration and implementation on all platforms and screens for games and interactive experiences. So we work with some of the biggest clients and IP in the world. We work with Sony, Microsoft, Nintendo. We've worked on titles like the Call of Duty franchise, Halo, God of War, Uncharted. And those are very demanding, very immersive uh, narrative experiences. And so we provide the support to those teams to make sure that the audio comes to life. I've been in audio and in this industry now almost 20 years. I have a background in music. I did my undergraduate degree and my master's from the New England Conservatory of Music in Boston. And uh, previously I was senior audio director at Microsoft at the Xbox team. And before that I was the COO of Pyramind Studios in San Francisco. My background with Nuendo is relatively new. I, I switched over to the platform almost exclusively about six years ago and it was such a revelation to finally find something that was completely platform agnostic, had pipelines and power for everything that I wanted to do, and was stable. And the thing that's always struck me about Nuendo is the team and all the people behind the product are so communicative and so involved. They're so interested in what can we do to make it better? How do we improve this? How do we even understand what the next pipelines are? So I've gotten into some wonderful dialogue with, with Steinberg and with Yamaha folks, um, and they've immediately responded with, that's a great idea, we have some other people who want that same feature, and the best thing about it is it shows up in the next rev. I mean, they let us know that, yep, this is in the roadmap, and then there it is. So the dialogue between the tool set and the creators is one of the most special things I've ever experienced with the tool set. It's been pretty great, and I, I mean, I'll, I can't go anywhere else. For me, Nuendo is really the only game in town as far as uh, game production and game development, uh, simply because of the productivity uh, features and the way that you can export out content with an incredible amount of accuracy that you can trace all the way through uh, into the actual integration is amazing. As Director of VoiceOver Services, I am responsible for overseeing our recording studios that we have in both West LA and also in Burbank. We specialize mostly in voiceovers for video games and anything interactive. Just like all the different departments in Formosa kind of piece together all the different aspects of game development from VO to music to sound design and mix, uh, you can actually do the same thing within Nuendo all within one package. Uh, it's incredibly versatile and it allows me to go seamlessly from the initial concepting uh, to system design to actual content creation and then I'm able to use uh, Game Audio Connect to actually integrate it into WISE and it really follows me from end to end. I tend to handle uh, projects where they need someone who has uh, a bit more experience from an interactive perspective. Something will come in through the door and uh, they'll say, hey, can we get sounds for you know this thing? I think it'll only need about 20 sounds. And oftentimes it's my job to say, well, you probably need at least 2,500 sounds bare minimum. They can come to Formosa and they can have a team that's working specifically on the sound design um, and then that team can hand off to the integration department uh, or sometimes the sound designers are the integrators because lots of times you need that iterative uh, aspect of design, implement, test in tools, make revisions and that informs your sound design from the very beginning. We use a lot of different tools. We're across different DAWs and different middlewares and we're very fair across them. It's really whatever our client needs. But for myself and for some of my colleagues, Nuendo has become the core tool that we use. And whenever I'm making content or some of my other colleagues are making content, this is the core shell that we start with. And uh, I recently worked on Halo Wars 2, and that whole team in, in the UK was using Nuendo, so it was a great fit for me to be based in the US, and they were in the UK, and, and the Creative Assembly team and I were working together in the same DAW. So, Nuendo plays a big role in, in our content creation here. Steinberg has uh, always been there from the very beginning with uh, the game audio uh, industry. 
I've been a longtime Nuendo user. I've actually started using Nuendo since version 1.0 back you know, many, many years ago. Um, I always found that it was incredibly intuitive for me. I would think, if only I needed to do this, I would, oh, it is, it is right there. One aspect of interactive audio that's different than linear audio is that we have to not only build things in layers, but then we export those in layers and we uh, integrate each of those layers so that everything is being called all sort of like a DAW, but uh, in runtime. So when the player is playing the game, that's how it gets mixed. That's how it gets uh, actually edited, is sandwiching all of this content that we create, and it uh, comes out when you're moving your little guy around. When you're working for games, you're really scoring the possibility. You don't have any precognition. You don't really know what's going to happen. So you have to create music content that can support game states or player states or, or things that could happen in the game. And you need to work with tool sets that help you kind of DJ the experience on the fly. Knowing that we have middleware tools that does that, it's great that we now have Nuendo as a platform that integrates with middleware. So it'll help you with linear and non-linear workflows simultaneously. I love working in games and I love non-linear music challenges. That's something I've spent a long time in my career working on. But if you're someone who's new to the industry and you don't even know where to start, well, the nice thing about Nuendo is it'll support your linear scoring and it'll support non-linear content creation all in one. Nuendo's capability uh, for game audio creators is, is staggering, and I think that it's only just started. And I think anyone who's serious about making content for games should look at Nuendo as a platform, because there's nothing that Nuendo is doing that isn't in direct support and can augment and can help existing game audio pipelines and also future pipelines.